general. So according to this Hollywood reporter, this article, if you read that, looks like uh, Bob Iger is not that happy with uh, Kevin Feige, who has been giving, I guess at this point, or should I say, according to last year, there was some flop for Marvel, especially the Marvels was a huge flop. So in the Ant-Man, many other movie, especially all his decision to you know leave all these big characters behind, especially Captain America, Iron Man, you know, thought he's still around, but I guess the biggest character like Captain America and Iron Man, you know, he decided to leave them behind. He neither he recast them, neither he redo them. At this point, looks like according to Bob Iger, he is not that happy with Kevin Feige, all his decision, although he's not saying he's angry at him, but sounds like they are looking into this Marvel franchise, which is I guess end of the day, this is the franchise was making Disney all this money, you know, billion dollar movie after billion dollar movie. End of the day, only movie made money last year was Garden of the Galaxy 3, which is almost cost 800 to something. So, you know, um, end of the day, Marvel is the only studio still making money for Disney. Uh, so no wonder Bob Iger, he is giving his opinion on MCU. And according to this article from Hollywood Reporter. Although I did hear this rumor that he's not happy with all the Kevin Feige decision. But if I read this, sounds like those all those rumors might be true. Then again, I think Kevin Feige, he was trying to do something new here, obviously. And uh, he tried to say goodbye to all those OG character everybody loved. Unfortunately, all this new character, some of them are really loved, I think. Uh, However, the Eternal movie, all those uh, characters, no, none of them actually made that much mark. Uh, uh, however, his decision to not recasting uh, T'Challa, I think that also bad decision. I think they could have recast him, uh, but they don't. <laughs> they don't want to disrespect Chadwick Bosnia, which is I understand. But that character, I think anybody can take off that mantle. But you know, Kevin Feige is not doing that but according to bob Iger, he's looking into this and he's saying that uh, according to uh Hollywood reporter CEO Bob Iger has made a statement concerning the future of company marvel in particular uh, this involves switching gear dive firmly into brand most successful character as i was saying some of this character i mentioned i suppose uh, while this might seem reductive it can pay off the restoring goodwill of mcu that's right uh, that is why i guess they are working on a spider-man movie all this rumor we are hearing which is i guess end of the day these are very exciting of course uh but like uh, Bob Iger, he's saying to Hollywood Reporter, you know, uh, Disney division is starting to focus some of his strongest franchises going forward. I'll leave it to that. I guess he, that is why he's bringing Moana too, uh, which makes sense, I guess. Yeah, and uh, he's also, yeah, some of this movie, I guess, uh, you know, movies like Eternal and other Doctor Strange. Although I personally like Doctor Strange Multiverse of Madness, uh, but... You know, uh, especially he's really proud of Black Panther. So that's interesting. Yeah. So according to this, it uh, sounds like Bob Iger. He also understand, you know, these characters, they need to be around. Uh, although Kevin Feige, he tried to bring, you know, uh, all these new characters. Some of them were successful. Some of them were not. Uh, I think the, you know, the lo Thor Love and Thunder, that movie was such a disappointment for me personally. I couldn't believe it. That movie was like, like they ruined Thor and uh, yeah, Black Panther Wakanda forever. Although I like that movie, you know, I liked name or in that, uh, but uh, yeah. So recently, of course, there was another article that Marvel is moving uh, away from Kang. Uh, so these are very interesting rumor about what is going to happen with MCU. But end of the day, sounds like Bob Iger, he is looking into, you know, uh, what Kevin Feige is doing these days. Uh, I, I don't think he's mad at Kevin Feige. I think he's just, you know, asking him, you know, focus on the character people love. And what is wrong with that? I think it's very interesting, honestly. I think, I think personally, because I would love to see, you know, Wonder, Doctor Strange and other character I like so much, them to be around, you know. I really like Doctor Strange, Mount of Madness. A lot of people did, didn't like 
I liked it. Uh, I, I just didn't like the marbles and the Ant-Man. That movie was so bad. These two movies were really bad. Eternal for me, it was okay. It, I did not hate that movie. Then, But I understand why that movie fell up at the box office. I guess end of the day, they need to slow down also on MCU TV show on Disney+. Plus. For now, this is, sounds really promising and that's my thought on this. Let me know in the comment. What do you think about this? If you enjoyed about this video, don't watch another videos on other topics. If you enjoyed this, please subscribe until I see you next time. Please take care.